Hello readers, our next book of the day is titled Big Friends, written by Linda Sarah and Benji Davies. Big Friends Two cardboard boxes big enough to sit in hide inside. Bert and Etho take them out each day, climb up Sudden Hill, and sit in them. Sometimes they're kings, soldiers, astronauts. Sometimes they're pirates sailing wild seas and skies. But always, always they're big friends. They're sailing, running, leaping, flying. Their chatter and giggles, him and Ethel. Their silences and watching small movements in the valley and feeling big as giant kings. Bert loves their two by two rhythm. And then one Monday, it's cramping cold. They meet another box carrier who wants to join them. This tiny boy's called Shu. He's watched Bert and Etho every day and finally found a big enough box and courage to ask if he can play too. Etho smiles and says, sure. And so the three sit in their boxes, watch one kestrel and two lost clouds. Sometimes they're dragon slayers, side by side house dwellers and skyscraper dancers. But Bert feels strange. One night, Bert smashes his box, stamps on it, rips it to bits. His dad shouts something flat from the front room about being quiet, and that's enough. Bert stops going up Sudden Hill. Ethel and Shu stop by sometimes. Bert avoids them. Instead, he stays at home, mostly drawing pictures of two boxes, side by side. But he misses Ethel. He misses their cardboard castles on Sudden Hill. One day, a knock on the door. He hears Shu's voice. We made you something. Please come out. All Bert can see as he peeks from the curtain is a box. But it's much, much more than a box. It's got bright, waving things attached to it like huge kites. It's got colors. It's got sound. It's got, it's got wheels. The huge box on wheels that they call Mr. Climb Fierce is hauled up Sudden Hill. It's amazing. An incredible monster creature box thing. It's a supersonic rocket blaster, a triple jet transformer, a sparkling glitter king. It's even got boxes inside, one with cookies, one with lemonade. Bert likes shoe. Shoe is kind. Shoe is funny. Shoe is 
daring and brave. Bert loves their time together. Their etho shoo shoo er ness. Bert loves their time together. It's a little tongue twister. Their etho shoo ert enus. What's that mean, readers? He loves their three by three rhythm. It's new and it's good. 